Well, an investigation is underway after an iconic Detroit venue went up in flames. Yeah, it hosted some legendary acts. Now the Illich family, which owns that building, will have to determine what comes next. 7 Action News reporter Ali Hoxie is live at the scene on cast near Peterborough, Midtown, Detroit. And Ali, what's going to be happening out there today? Well, this morning, fire investigators are expected back out here to try and look at this building and determine the cause. As you can see, the walls are still here, but inside someone threw some bird scooters in there. That's why there's that blinking light, but you can see the roof is gone and the inside just looks completely destroyed. This is video of what it looked like last night. Fire crews say they got the call shortly after 830 and then shortly after that, the Detroit skyline could be seen engulfed and smoke. This used to be the gold dollar bar back in the 90s. The white stripes used to play here. It's been closed for more than a decade. Olympia Development, which owns the building, is a part of a division of the Illich family. They sent us a statement last night that read in part, we are aware of the fire at the gold dollar building. We will cooperatively work with the Detroit Fire Department to determine the cause. Since the building is vacant, no one was inside at the time, which means no one was hurt. Also, no one hurt fire crews when they were out here battling this fire. Reporting live in Midtown, Ali Hoxie, 7 Action News.